If you were going on a long hike, what would you do to prepare? Have proper footwear, for sure. Take appropriate clothing for the weather, and maybe a hat. Find a map of the area, so you'll have some idea where you were heading. You'll want some trail mix for energy, and lots of water to keep yourself hydrated. A mental health recovery journey can be a lot like a long hike. Only these trails aren't evenly paved or have a nice bed of gravel, mulch, or leaves. They are, more likely, not even fit for passage yet. Dark and overgrown, mucky puddles, big rocks, surface roots to trip you up, and fallen trees you'll have to climb over. And it's easy to understand why there is no one clear path. First, when we embark on a recovery journey, we are all starting from very different points, following any one of the numerous diagnoses of mental illness or disorder. Second, we all experience very different symptoms, warning signs, and challenges as a result of these diagnoses, and they affect each of us differently as well. Third, we all have our own unique identities with diversity in our upbringings, cultures, and values. In our search for communities of support, acceptance, and compassion, we often take very different routes. And finally, we all face our own individual struggles and barriers, which can add exponentially to the challenges we face as a result of our mental health. With so many variables, it's easy to see why there's not just one clear, paved pathway to recovery. At Sarah Riel, we have uncovered four paths that could make our journey easier and help us to reach our path to full potential. At Sarah Riel, we offer support in finding a path to self. Self-stigma can occur when we internalize public attitudes. If we listen to what others say about mental health and those struggling with it, we can focus on the elements of our behavior that could be true and start to believe we are weak or broken. And we have enough barriers in our way without putting more in for ourselves. Re-establishing our sense of self-worth and making it an unfaltering part of who we are can give us the strength to persevere despite barriers put in the way of us reaching our path to full potential. At Sarah Riel, we can assist in creating a path to wellness. Recovery is hard work, and we need to keep ourselves strong enough to prevail. We need to understand our mental health diagnoses and the potential symptoms as best we can. We need to be able to recognize the early warning signs of onset and identify clear strategies that work to lessen any negative effect. In addition to our mental health, we need to ensure that we can manage and balance our overall health and wellness in all aspects of our lives, mental, physical, emotional, social, and spiritual. Having plans and strategies that work for us to ensure our wellness can reduce the worry of becoming unwell and give us the confidence to move forward to our path to full potential. At Sarah Riel, we can help you build a path to hope. Hope is a necessary element throughout a recovery journey. It can sometimes be the only thing that keeps us moving forward in the face of adversity. The wonderful thing about hope is that it promises future reward. What do you hope for? Love? Acceptance? Understanding? A reduction of your pain? These do exist, though you may not have experienced them yet. But you'll never experience them if you give in to despair. You need to have hope. Therefore, the ability to learn methods to develop, build on, foster, and maintain hope are key to our success in reaching our path to full potential. At Sarah Riel, we can aid in generating a path to empowerment. We can often be left disheartened and demoralized 
when we don't achieve big goals we've set for ourselves, and it can make us leery to see how goal setting can ever help in solving any of our problems. But learning how to set goals effectively and break them down into smaller realistic segments is a surefire way to ensure ongoing achievement. And who doesn't love to celebrate successes while still working toward our main goal? It takes patience and practice, but the more skilled we become, building mastery and setting and achieving goals, the greater our ability to take back full control of our lives. Learning the strategies to ensure success can build both our confidence and our competence and get us ready to tackle our path to full potential. What supports are you going to need for your journey? Mental health counseling, short-term and solution-focused. Case management, leading to successful self-management. Community mentorship, independent living skills development. Supported housing program with intensive wraparound supports. Employment services, prepare for, find, get, and keep meaningful employment. Seneca services, peer supported respite. Like any journey into unknown territory, the first step can always be the hardest. Let Sarah Riel help.